good morning. Welcome to day six. I don't know. <laughs> it's Thursday. It's a sea day. And uh, we are at sea somewhere between Alaska and Canada. Probably closer to Canada than we are to Alaska. So I'm going to hang out. It might be a lazy day. So come on with us and we'll see what happens. Well, I'm extremely backlit, but uh, giving you an update, uh, we didn't do too good at trivia this morning. So I um, kind of walked around, killed some time, we went to actually see a movie. Uh, they were showing a movie in the Princess Theater. We went to see The Lost City with uh, Channing Tatum and Sandra Bullock. And it wasn't bad, it wasn't my cup of tea necessarily, but it was better than I expected. So uh, now we're sitting in Explorer's Lounge, as you can probably hear, there's a uh, art auction going on, and uh, we're actually here to see a uh, comedy magician. It's uh, going to start here in a few minutes, so we're going to watch that show and then uh, see where the rest of the day takes us. So, hang out. So another update, uh, apparently looked at the schedule wrong, and the comedy magician wasn't where we thought he was going to be, so uh, it's time to come back over to the piazza, and it's going to be a... Um, some music here by the uh, house band. I'm gonna be playing some jazz here in a little bit. And you know, I do love me some jazz. So uh, I'm gonna have a beverage and sit here and listen to some music and just continue a lazy sea day. All right, update time. Um, enjoyed that jazz set. The uh, house band here on the Crown Princess is fantastic. Uh, great band, um, great jazz set. Nice, uh, nice little relaxing, uh, smooth jazz in the afternoon. So that was really uh, getting nice. Getting ready to clean up, get ready for dinner. Uh, it's lobster night in the main dining room. So we're gonna check that out. Uh, and then there's a show tonight called Encore. Uh, probably gonna check that out as well and um, you know being a couple of old folks like we are probably uh, probably call it a night after that but uh, we still got a couple things to do so hang with us and we'll see how this day ends good so far all right so update to the dinner situation we went back to Botticelli's after we had a, a bad experience on the first night uh, because of the vibration, the noise, and so forth. Tonight was 110% better. Uh, we actually sat at the front end of the dining room, uh, so the vibration wasn't nearly as bad as it is in all the way in the back. Uh, food was excellent. Uh, service was excellent. Much, much better experience in Botticelli's. So we're back in the cabin after a good dinner and a really good show. Uh, encore uh, with the uh, princess dancers and singers, amazing talent. Um, and I, I don't remember any of the names they introduced them each. Uh, but they had a guest soprano, uh, and this girl does not need to be on a cruise ship. She needs to be at the Metropolitan Opera. I mean, she is phenomenal hit notes that only a dog could hear. I mean, <laughs> this girl had an amazing voice, amazing range. 
Um, but the show, again, was called Encore. If you're ever on a Princess Cruise, you get a chance to see it. Check it out. It it was, it. I mean, mind blown. Uh, but that was really good. And then, actually, we were uh, planning on coming back to the cabin and just turning in for the night. But we stumbled across the marriage match game, which are like the newlywed game, uh, love and marriage, you know, different names, different cruises. Uh, but that was actually... Uh, very funny, as it always is. It's fun. Uh, so we did that, and uh, now we're in the cabin, getting ready to call it a night. Uh, tomorrow is more or less a sea day. Uh, we do have a port in Victoria, British Columbia, in Canada, um, or Canada, as some people say. Uh, we're uh, supposed to be there about 7 o'clock, I think, tomorrow night. Uh, most of the day tomorrow is a sea day. Uh, we're planning to do the steakhouse for dinner tomorrow night, so excited about that. That should be fun and very tasty. Uh, so as far as what goes on during the day tomorrow, might be some trivia, might be some sitting in the cabin watching a movie. You know, I'm, I'm old and you never know what I'm going to do. So uh, stick around with us. Uh, uh, we'll, we'll see you tomorrow and we'll see what we get into. Night, night. Well, good morning and welcome to Friday, our last day on the Crown Princess. Sad face. So, I <laughs> uh, got a bad breakfast this morning. Uh, we're pretty much at sea all day. Uh, scheduled to get into uh, Victoria, British Columbia, Canada. Some people call it Canada. Uh, should be in there about seven o'clock tonight. I think it's what we're shooting for. Uh, it's a nighttime call kind of strange because I've never had a nighttime call like that uh, but we're from like 7 to midnight uh, may just make it a ship day may just stay on the ship may just get off and walk around just to say we've been to uh, Victoria so uh, not much going on today there's a couple of trivias that we're gonna try to get into uh, see if we can come away with some fantastic prize uh, probably take it easy on lunch today because we have reservations tonight at the Crown Grill. So that uh, that is ex exciting. I'm definitely looking forward to uh, to the Crown Grill tonight. So hang out with us, see what we get into, and welcome to Friday. If I don't win trivia, at least I've got a nice view. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Is it this loud for the morning? But you used to me, I'm loud anyway. Alright, so we just finished morning trivia, general knowledge trivia. And I don't know, you might say I did okay. Picked up the official Princess Cruises line uh, stopper. <laughs> but uh, anyway, um, not sure what we're going to do now. i walk around a little bit, hang out, maybe go back to the room, watch a movie. I don't know. There's not a whole lot going on until about 1 o'clock is the next trivia. Uh, so we'll see what we get into. Come on. <laughs> so this has become one of my favorite places to eat on the ship. The beef in Guinness pie is the bomb. So I got a chicken and cashew Waldorf salad and the beef and Guinness pie. More trivia time. A medallion net. Yes, the disconnect from the Wi-Fi. You can use your notes on your phone. I won't be checking, but I'm sure the friends next to you will be double checking to make sure. So we're looking at the yes no game show. Three minutes without saying yes or no. And I signed up. So we'll see how I'll it goes. Say yes or no in any other language. Yes, you cannot say it in any other language. You also cannot 
nod or shake your head, that will get you disqualified. If you cannot uh, repeat yourself, uh, you cannot repeat okay, yourself. Do you understand the uh, rules as we have explained them? We have not started yet. Don't worry. Get nice and close to the mic. Your... Are you yes. cruising with your parents? Um... Watch that nope. hesitation. Oh, that's a no. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh... Conferences? Maybe. <laughs> you seem unsure. <laughs> So I did the yes, no game show. Had to last three minutes without saying yes or no. I got up there and in two minutes and 25 seconds, I said, yeah. So I did not win. Got a little uh, drawstring backpack. That's a consolation prize, so that was not bad. So now I'm uh, back in uh, Club Fusion. Gonna do the 4.30 trivia called let's quiz again like we did last summer so <laughs> we'll see how we do with that we'll, we'll give it a shot coming up in just a couple minutes didn't make it uh we got 18 out of 20 uh got into a tiebreaker and lost it in a tiebreaker didn't know what year the first superman comic came out uh, it was fun anyway so now we're uh, just kind of hanging out having a beverage and uh, waiting for our uh, reservation time at Crown Grill, which we're looking forward to. And then after dinner, we'll probably slip over into Canada. Some people call Canada. Um, slip over into Victoria for a little bit, walk around, check things out. So come along with us. We'll, uh, we'll see what we see. in the cabin uh, finished up dinner at Crown Grill which was excellent thoroughly enjoyed it uh, but decided because of the short time the evening stop still having to do some packing and get everything ready to go <clears throat> we're just gonna call it a ship night and not uh, not get off the ship here in Victoria Canada uh, we're only here for a couple hours anyway so I uh, wouldn't have a lot of time to do anything, but really just kind of get off and walk around. So we're going to pass and go ahead and finish packing and get everything ready for debarkation in the morning uh, so that we can get on the plane and head back home. So this will wrap up the, the video. Hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, be sure and hit the like button down there and also hit the subscribe button so you know when we come out with our next video. So. Uh, we appreciate you watching. Have a great day. Make sure you cruise early and often. And if you need anything at all, remember LNC Cruises. You can find us on Facebook. You can find us here on YouTube. You can email us at LNC Cruises 15, uh, LNC Cruises 15 at gmail.com. You can email us and we'll be happy to help you out with any of your travel plans. So uh, take care of yourself, travel safe, and God bless you, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>